Well, it's grumpy guts. Here. Why aren't you in school? Because I missed the bus. Here, we'll get the next one. You're better to go back. Just do it. You got that caliper off yet? <sighs> Spanners, Bob. I mean it, Debbie. Skedaddle. I don't want the wagman on my case. I couldn't change out this stuff. Well, look all right to me. I don't think this is a good idea. You aren't feeling sorry for him, are you? No. Because you shouldn't. It was him who got you in trouble and then blew you and the baby out. Why are you doing this? Well, what do you think? There's a choice between spending the day listening to your old man moaning non-stop or going off with you. And there's no contest. But if you don't want to, then it's no big deal. I know what a hard time you've had, and I'm not going to be another who takes advantage. You mean like Andy? Well, you'd know better than me. When me and him got together, I thought it was forever. <laughs> Go on, take the mic. I don't blame you for being taken in. He wasn't stringing me along with it. Well, I'm sure he meant what he said at the time. But you've got to remember that he's damaged goods. What's that supposed to mean? Well, it's not his fault his dad's a nutter. And there's some things Andy's done that I wouldn't tell anybody. His head's in a mess. And when Katie dumped him because she liked me better, he couldn't take it. So he wasn't going to say no when you tipped up. And you didn't. So? I'm not going to fall for it again with you. But there's one big difference between us and what happened with you and him. What, like, you're cool and he isn't? You. Back then, you were just a kid, impressed by the first older lad to show some interest. And now you're a woman. I think you know exactly what you want. Why don't you have more boyfriends, then? Could if I wanted. So why not? Well, who is the man where we live? Daz. He's a Muppet. Oh, it's all right. Why don't I go out with him, then? Because it's a Muppet. Well, there must be some at school. They're all idiots. And even if they weren't, they wouldn't mile with me having server. Well, they must be mad. You're yeah, right. They must. And you've not been a baby weren't enough, being called Dingle is. Especially with a dad like mine. Are you your own person? I don't feel like it sometimes, though. Can I kiss you? Get lost. Please. It's all that wine talking. I've hardly had any. I'm not risking losing my licence. You can still get lost. But you wanted to the other day. Go on. Just one kiss. Why? Because I really want it. You better not tell anyone, then. And why would I? Happy now? Not yet, no. No, Rob. Come on, let's have some fun. No. Rob, get off me! What are you doing? It was only a bit of fun. Debbie! How did you get in? I'm a dingle. Don't make me a slapper. I know. I'm sorry. Right, you better take me back. And what are you going to do? Why? You're bricking it in case I tell my dad? No. Well, I got carried away. And do you know why? Yeah, cos lads are all the same. Maybe. But all that stuff I said about really liking you, I meant it. Thanks. You got the food and drink? For not making a big deal when I got carried away. Grope me. I'm sorry. Yeah, I am too, for getting out my pram. And you're entitled to. I've never done anything like that before. So what are we going to do? Oh, it's up to you. At least you know how I feel about you now.
Three guesses. It's for you, love. To help you with your education. What software's it got? What what? Well, it looks very nice anyway. <laughs> How was your day, love? Yeah, it was all right. We did a bit of IT. Mm -hmm. Where's Sarah? Dell's put her down for a nap. You've been up to something. What are you on about? Something different about you. Well, she can't have been deflowered again. Oh, shut up. Hmm? Tell us. Yeah, that's right, Daddy. I wagged it and then had it off with someone on the back seat of a car. Andy Sugler's not been after you again, has he? Andy's not interested. He's made that plain enough. And better not be. Can I go and see my daughter now? <laughs>